Hey guys, welcome back to Myth Survival. So in this video today, I'm going to show you guys something really awesome and freak at the same time. So there's a big present behind this door and it is my tilted bucky, my tilted truck as a lot of people know it. Yeah, actually what happened was, I did mention this in one of my previous videos, is I was driving down here. I brought some of these lockers and as I was driving here, my car just flipped forward. So as you guys can see, there's nothing on the floor at all. I mean, there is a branch, but could that have been a branch? I mean, like, seriously. So, anyway, we're going to tilt this thing back. And I did actually see, I think it was in the workbench, to be exact, that you can build a carjack device. So, this is actually, it seems really interesting. I don't have an actual idea, actual idea of... Will this tip the car back over? I mean, if they, if the producers of this game did enable the fact that your car can roll so much, um, yeah, they should have brought something to help you tilt it back. So otherwise, you guys know that I usually have a station wagon uh, here as well, and I actually went to the city. I went past the city by a tree. Uh, I went around the tree and I actually fell off of the road and I got stuck on like underneath the road i can say like that that's actually like a big glitch so i want to see if this car jack can actually get it back up and then i'll go back to my station wagon i'll show you guys where it is to give you guys an idea where i got stuck and where you guys should really be careful around in that case so for this we are going to need a bunch of stuff i think we're going to need some metal scraps uh let's just take that as you guys can see i was definitely at a city i did a lot of looting you're going to need that we're gonna need that we're gonna need gears we're gonna need three gears so we're gonna probably end up making some uh i think i don't have any more gears um if i had where would i put it let's just check in our lockers uh clean clean okay there's all my medical stuff some of my food uh more food and some of my guns and stuff so gear crafting okay so we don't actually have any extra gear so we're gonna have to make some more i mean it always gives me the most pain on making these gears i'm not even gonna lie as you guys will see now for me to make the gears we're gonna have to give eight of these scrap metals just to get four so and then for us to make a gear we need four of these ignots so it is actually really expensive making these things so we're gonna go and melt those so long uh, we're gonna need a tire to make one as well. Okay, so I've got three tires over here. Let's just see which one is the lowest percentage. Alright, all three of their percentage is actually at max. So while those are gonna make, uh, let's quickly see the car, open the hood. All of them are 100%, but this one is not 100%. So we're gonna take this one off. No, what am I doing? Alright, proceed. Right, and we're gonna put this 100% tire in its place. So I think I do have some lower percentage tires on my station wagon because I've been using that one most of the time. But in this case, we're gonna use this one for now, and I think it should be probably done by now. There we go. All right, so it's actually still busy. It's got five minutes left. So let's see what else we need. All right, so we're gonna go back over there, all the way down. So we're going to need 20, 10 of those, 5 of those, 2 of those, and 1 tire. Alright, so because we need 1 tire, we're going to go and drop 2 of these so long. Drop, and move back a little bit, and drop. There we go, perfect laying against each other like wife uh, and husband. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to come back here, let's see if it's done. I keep on coming to the wrong one. So 1 minute left, we might as well just wait for them. It's gonna be one hell of a minute guys I mean we can't even go to sleep for one minute so that's gonna be a waste oh wait 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 there we go zero minutes so it's probably gonna be in seconds it's seconds now there we go it's done good stuff so we're gonna come over here we're gonna make the gears as you guys can see we made two gears honestly this is gonna take very long so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna uh, make each one separately the problem is, is because we are outside, so sometimes when you're outside, it will get misty, and if it gets misty, you'll be attacked by these creature stuff, so yeah, just always be aware of what's going on around you. If this was inside, and I could have closed the door, then yeah, by all means, I would definitely do both of them at the same time. Right, so once again, here we can close the doors, I'm not sure how long this car jack is going to take. Um... Car jack, there we go. So we're gonna make one of those. It's gonna take one hour and thirty minutes. It's a good thing that we are gonna make it uh, in the closed doors. 
there we go so as you guys can see let's just make sure okay it's in my inventory you can open this as well there we go it's in my inventory so car jack device so let's see how we use this thing um open doors open wood yeah i can't see that we can put it over here somewhere oh there's something there oh it's a leaf um what is that circle thing you know let's see if we can like put it in our slot. oh we can put it in our slot use device on car Oh, there we go. We can actually do this. So this action will take 30 minutes. It's fine. I mean, this is really cool. At least we can tilt our cars back up. Oh, that is so much better, guys. Let's just go park this thing back into its spot. Oh, let's see. Get it back in there. Seems about to be stationed properly. No, it's not. Gotta get it a bit more forward. There we go. Out we go. Alright, perfect, and yeah, it will stick out a bit at the back, I mean, for myself, as long as the front part is under cover, I'm, I'm happy. So anyway, there we go, we got our car back up again. So now we're gonna run all the freaking way to the city, just to show you guys exactly where that car is. So at this given time, I think I'm gonna need some water. It's a very, very far run, guys. I'm probably gonna have to do a huge cut on this. I'm not even gonna fast forward it, it's just gonna take too long. So then maybe you guys can see how my other car... How it's positioned, and you know, again, you don't have to, uh, you gotta stay away from that. So, once again, I was thinking of actually taking this Bucky, this truck of mine. Sorry, guys, you're in our country in South Africa, we call them uh, Bucky's. So, yeah, the thing about him is, I was actually thinking of uh, driving it there instead of like just running there, because if I'm gonna have to run there from this entire way, it's gonna take probably forever. Uh, it's really far, but if I take this vehicle there, how am I going to bring two vehicles back? So unfortunately, I can't do that. I'm going to have to run. I've got actually no energy bars or something. Maybe I should just get some. They are really, really important, especially if you're going to take long runs like I'm about to now. So anyway, I'm talking too much now, guys. I'll be with you guys right now, then I'll show you guys where that car is. So I've ran all the way from the White House and here is the city. So this is the back of the city. The entrance is on this side. Here is the garage is at the back side. So here is the tree that I've mentioned guys. I've literally ran around this tree. Uh, so yeah, I went down this road. I just wanted to see what else was in this area. Maybe there was another city at the back or just something else for us to be able to use and loot. And as you guys can see, there's my car. You can literally, I think you can even literally as in literally go underneath the road. What is that? Oh, it's just... Yeah, let's see if we can go underneath it. As you guys can see, you can see straight through it. So this is something they are gonna have to fix. And my car was turning and the rear end just dropped off. So anyway, because I was just trying to slow down and it was just way too late for that. So anyway, here we go. We are gonna go to our car jack. We're gonna use it on this car. Uh, we're gonna turn it to face that way. And proceed 30 minutes. So once again, we are actually outside. It can go misty at any moment. And we are lucky that it's not misty. So let's start it up. And there we go. We can actually get out of here. I didn't see there was a, a way here. There we go, guys. We are out. So yes, if you guys did find this helpful in any other way or educational, please don't forget to drop a like on this video. Otherwise, if you guys want to see a similar video, press the icon on the left. If you guys want to see my latest video, press the icon on the right. If you guys would love to subscribe to the channel, hit the logo at the bottom right, and then I'll see all of you guys a little bit later.